Hi guys, this is Movie Man with Master Dancer here, <laughs> and we will be reviewing Batman vs. Superman Dawn of Justice. So, <laughs> oh, okay, this film I thought was going to be easily one of my favorite films of the year. I Unfortunately, I hate to say this, it is one of my most disappointing films of all year. Um, well, I, I liked it. I liked it. It was what, really good. What I did... I'll just state the stuff I liked first and then the stuff I didn't like next. So, what I did like was I liked how they brought a more brooding and dark tone like they did with The Dark Knight and how how Batman is a very aged and broken person. That's what the comics were about and that's what they portrayed on screen. So, I liked what they did with Batman. I'll give you that. I liked the... Um, uh, I liked... Uh, <laughs> hey! I liked Gail Gada as Wonder Woman. I liked... The film was... The f action was good. It was action-packed. I liked that. On to the disadvantages of this Zack Schneider movie. Okay, so... Hey, no! This film... Um, first off, this film was way too long. It was two hours and... I think two hours and 30 minutes, I think. I believe that it was. And me and this girl here, we saw this film opening night in theaters and it was, it was a crowded theater and that you will not believe how many groans you heard in the theater because it was so long. They could have cut this down to two hours and... Hey, there wasn't that 15 many 15 minutes. Two, two hours and 15 minutes, no. easily. As well as, I felt as... This film is called Batman vs. Superman. So you want to see Batman or Superman just beat the hell of each other in this movie. But there was hardly any fighting between Batman and Superman. It was like well, eight minutes out of a two-hour movie. That's what I came to the movie to see, is these two fight. Okay. And they did it. Okay, well, what's, your, what's your thought on the movie? I, I really liked it. It was really good. I don't know how. Like, hey. I'm sorry, honey. <laughs> this film was terrible. It was just... It, <laughs> It had good action. I'll give you that. It had good action. But you have to agree with me on this. There were a lot of plot holes. Like, they would say something, but then they wouldn't explain it later. Like, they would go, here's the scene, yes, they would. but yeah, we're not going to tell you what it's about. Yeah, they like, there's would. a scene... <laughs> or, oh, by the way, I, this is a spoiler-filled review. There's a scene in the movie where <laughs> Batman is sitting in a chair, and this guy pops out of the freaking air and goes, Help me, Batman! I'm going... What? And then it's just, and then nothing is mentioned of that again. I'm like, was he on drugs? Like, what the <laughs> hell? What was that? So, like, they don't elaborate on what they give you. And as well as, I was just let down by Jesse Eisenberg. But honey, Jesse, it I was honey. It was really good. It was. I don't. No, it was good action pack sequences. It was good yeah. camera angles. But it, no, 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 but no, the no, villain no, was weak. No, no, no. The villain was weak. No, it wasn't. Jesse Eisenberg as Lex Luthor. Somebody made a comment um, that he's like Jim Carrey's The Riddler, with mixed with Johnny Depp's Willy Wonka, hyped up on a lot of cocaine. <laughs> and I'm like, that is the most accurate, but accurate thing you can say about his portrayal but as Lex Luthor. Mm -hmm. The most riveting thing he does in this film is he pops a starburst into somebody's mouth. You're going, oh. He's making, like, going ding-dong, the bell is going at the end of the movie. I'm going, what? And... Yeah, that was the confusing part. And but then, I didn't... I got the rest of it. Batman's it was giving really people good. weird tattoos just, and... No, no, no. No, they didn't. He and just, also, they completely destroyed <laughs> Batman. No, the, no they just, didn't. Let me just say no, this. No, no, let no, me no, just no, say no, this. No, in no, the no, comics... No. In the comics, he... In the very yeah, no, in the, no, no. In the very they first few comics, to the comments. no, comments. but that's what the fans and do. That's what they will always do. But listen, in the Dark Knight, <laughs> if you saw the Dark Knight, the masterpiece two thousand and eight film, he does not kill people. He says he will break them, he will beat them, but he never murders. In this film, he's mowing people down with machine guns like it's nothing. I'm well, going. No. He just destroyed Batman's one rule. Out of fifty years of cinema, you just broke like, wow. You just you were just disloyal to the comics there. Hey, and no, you don't have to compare movies to the comics. But what, I, no, what if they want like something newer to the piece? But I will say this: 
Ben Affleck did do a really good job as Batman. I will give you that. Yes, he was. He was a really good Batman. <laughs> I um, loved... His, no, no. Nah, I loved his Batman. Yeah, she really liked Batman. <laughs> but, um, as far... Like, and then and then there's, like, two villains. There's this big freaking giant, like, lizard thing, and it's going, ah! And I felt like it's Godzilla coming in the movie now. I'm going, oh, my God, my intelligence is just going lower. So, I did not... Alright, I had... Yes, there are a lot of flaws in this film. There, I had problems with this movie. It was a good film. Yeah, sorry, I, I shouldn't say that. Say that. It was an okay movie. Could have done more. Yes. Could have it been better. Yes. But it was just a very hyped up. It was very disappointing for such a hyped up movie of one of the biggest films of the year. I give this film. Oh no. Okay. I give this film. A 5.4 out of 10. This film was How just... Dare you? This film was a letdown, but the only thing saving me from this was the great darkness they brought to Batman and the action. What was your rating, honey? I liked, um... Uh, my rating, it was, um... Na, 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 um... Eight... No. Nine. Point zero. It oh. was really, really good. I loved it. I'm sorry. There you go. That is a review on... Um, that's a spoiler-filled review on Batman vs. Superman Dawn of Justice. Uh, d- uh, what do you think? D- comment on what you thought. Did you see the movie? Did Did you like the movie? Do you agree with my thoughts or do you agree with my girlfriend's thoughts? Did you like it? <laughs> did you not like it? Do you think the film was long enough? Do you think it should have been longer? Do you think uh, Ben Affleck was a good Batman? Get us get in a stupid argument in the comment section below. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and Master Dancer here for some <laughs> great dance videos. Until I see you guys again, this is Movie Man, signing off.